Okay, now that we have our box with tabs, I'm just going to add a few holes um, the way we need to do them. We'll start with the side. Um, we want one hole sort of in the middle. Um, one really easy way to find the center of a of an object like this, I'm going to create a sketch. Well, I can just click there. And I'm going to place it right on that surface. And then I'm going to take a line and I'm going to go from one corner all the way to the other corner. So that's just a line. I'll hit escape to get out of there. Now, I'm also going to put a point. I want to put a point at the center. So I'm kind of tracing my cursor along. And at one point, you'll see, see that triangle? That means I've reached the center. So if I click, that means I have found the center of my, my object. And so I can do that. Then I finish my sketch and I want to create a hole. So I'll say hole. I'll click that point and I want it to be half an inch, which it is. And I'll just pivot this around so we can see. Um, remember that whatever happens to side one happens to side two because we copied them. So they're linked that way. So they're connected. And so when I say, okay, I get the two holes I want. Now what I want to do is put holes in the top and I want it to sort of be in this midpoint. I want three lines here so I can do the same thing where I, um, let's see, can I find the midpoint here? I don't think it'll work because of this geometry. Uh, so what we're going to do is do the same idea. I'm going to put a line from here to here. And then I'm going to add a point. I'm going to find the center. There it is. You see that triangle again? Okay, I'm going to add a point there. I'm going to just follow this along, put a point there, and I'm going to follow it this way and put a point. And I don't care exactly where. I'm just putting the points down. Because then what I can do, hit, I'm going to finish. Well, no, I'm not going to finish my sketch yet. I'm going to say escape to get out of that tool. And then I'm going to click the D. D is for dimensions. I feel like, yeah, sketch dimensions. So if you just click D, what what I know is that the box is three inches across and I'm going to have four different sections. So each section is going to be three quarters of an inch. So from here to here, I should make that 0 0.75. Oops, click that 0 0.75 from here to here i'm going to make that 0 0.75 and from here oh, and from here to here i'm going to make this 0 0.75 and then i can finish my sketch and i can add a hole to each of these one and if i hit the shift key I can pick one, two, three, and then I say OK. So now I've got, if you if you flip this around, you can see that I've got this just the way I want it. OK, so now what we want to do, well, let's let's stop this there and then we'll take it from there after.